what is going on everybody welcome back to coding with t today i want to share this animation with you guys which i think is so cool so here is a login activity with a toggle switch at the top which helps in the transition of day to night and vice versa so without any further ado let's dive into the android studio So first of all, go to your drawable directory and create a new drawable resource file. I will name it to day background and in this resource file, we will add a gradient for day background. In the same way, we will create another background resource file for our night sky. So now it's time to design our main activity. First of all, we will create two views which will hold our day and night skies. After this, I will create an image view which will hold the sun and I will also position it on my screen. After this, I will create two more image views which will hold our day and night landscapes. After this, we need to add a toggle button. So for this, go to build.gradle, this file and add this line of code here. After this, go to build.gradle module app and copy this dependency and paste it right here and then sync the project. I will provide the dependencies down into the description box. 
once it is synchronized close the unnecessary files and go to the main activity after adding the dependency i will implement my day and night switch and then i will set its attributes Now it's time to create edit texts for email and password field but I need to customize them so for this purpose go to drawable and create a new drawable resource file and rename it to edit text background I will set the border color of my edit text to white and width of the border should be 1 dp I will also set the radius of corners to let's say 10 dp. After this I will go back to my main activity and set two edit text fields for my email and password. Now that I am done with my XML file, I will go to the Java file of main activity and declare my variables first. I have three image views which is a sun, a day landscape and a night landscape and I have two views for my skies. After declaring the variables. I will bind them to their corresponding views with XML file. Now it's time to implement the logic behind the transition. First of all, I will set the sun vertically upwards let's say minus 110 dp 
I forgot to declare the variable of switch. I will create it and bind it as well. Then I will attach a listener with the switch. It will basically have an if and else statement. If it's night, then it will simply set the sun to its original position, which is behind the mountains. And it will eventually fade out day land and day sky. and the opposite situation will happen in else condition. You can also change these values according to your requirement. And we are done with our Java file as well. Now let's run the project. So as you can see our app is working absolutely fine. The animation is working pretty smoothly. And that was it for today's video. If you like my content, then like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well. Have a nice day. I will see you guys in the next video.